it is back to school time and you know many of us got new shoes for back to school but what do you do with those other pairs of shoes well i'm with rachel biggie and rachel you did a great collection of shoes last year for souls for souls mm -hmm. so what did you what happened with that thanks to your guys' help spreading the word we were able to raise around 1500 pairs of shoes wow yeah and after that i was able to go down to dominican republic which is one place where Souls for Souls delivers shoes, and we were able to give them to kids that needed them, and it was really awesome. Oh, that is amazing. And you really got to spend some time with the kids, too, played with them? Yes. That must have been so special. It was. So, Rachel, now there's a local angle for Souls for Souls. What's that? Yeah, there is. Um, when we got back from our mission trip, um, they had started up a shoe drop-off in Wilsonville, ah. which is very close and very convenient. And um, they reached out to us and asked us if we wanted to have some shoe bins in our local stores. And so will those shoes go back to the Dominican Republic? Um, they'll go all around the world, even oh. here around where we live. Ah, so really you can help locally too. Yeah. That's wonderful. And so we can go to any of the Owls Garden and Home and drop off our shoes for the whole fall. Yes. That is so great. And then there's, um, you can bring your shoes to any of the Owls and plus there's a website if you need more information. Um, and so it really we can help any of the kids all over the world and locally. So please go to Garden Time and we'll click you over to that website and you can find out more information. Rachel, thanks for all you do. It's wonderful. Thank you so much.